Netflix landing Anna Kendrick's dating game, serial killer tale woman of the hour for $11 million, in first big TIFF 2023 deal, ESPN, Disney Plus to present Toy Story style, animated NFL telecast, Drew Barrymore's talk show to return amid strike, WGA plans to pick it outside studio. In Switzerland, road closure adds to Gothard transport woes. In August, 2023, the Gothard Rail Tunnel, world's longest, closed after derailment. South American neighbors slam Argentina, over river tax on Paraguay and Bolivia, Brazil, Paraguay and Uruguay ask Argentina to lift unilateral tolls. Representative Marjorie Taylor Greene says states should consider seceding from the union. On 9-11 over Biden border policies, in the U.S., over 75 percent of voters want maximum age limit for elected officials, poll shows, in last-ditch play. Fifteen senators tell Blinken not to okay visa-free travel for Israelis. Egypt bans wearing the niqab, the face veil, in schools, and head covering is optional. Spain has lost a million young Catholics in 20 years. Fifteen years ago it had been reported that Spain had lost two million young people in 20 years. Flooding in Libya leaves 2,000 people feared dead and more missing after storm collapse dams, Antarctic research stations polluted its pristine wilderness, Malaysia to ban export of rare earths to boost domestic industry, U.S. and Saudi Arabia forge strategic partnership to secure critical metals in African nations for energy transition, EVS, Germany will force 80% of gas stations to install EV charging, 2. Canada's coffee brand Tim Hortons to open first shop in South Korea's Gangnam of Seoul in 2023. Tim Hortons coffee chain expands to Singapore, Malaysia, in Japanese Mare Ubini affiliation pact. FBI flags $40 million crypto cash out plot by North Korean hackers. Spain seizes 2.7 tons of cocaine on board a vessel. Japan child abuse cases hit record high of nearly 220,000 in FY 2022. India football coach Igor Stimic gave details of players to astrologer, pick team on his advice. Erdogan supports permanent UN Security Council membership for India, says Turkey would be proud to have India there. Kremlin officially confirms Kim Jong-un's visit to Russia, and North Korean leader Kim Jong-un arrives in Russia before an expected meeting with Putin. Baltic states Estonia, Latvia acquire 1B Euro German mid-range air defense system, the Iris T, British Army strength reduction confirmed for 2025. Two years ago, British Army set to be cut to 72,500 troops by 2025. FTX unveils holding of $1.16 billion in Solana, $200 million in Bahamas real estate, and $560 million in Bitcoin, court filing says, over 75 bidders contacted, for possible FTX 2.0 launch. At G20 summit, Argentine President Alberto Fernandez calls out Azerbaijan for painful blockade of Latin Corridor. Azerbaijan threatened Argentina after President Alberto Fernandez denounced the Azerbaijani blockade. European Commission bans Russians from entering EU by car, with valuables. Moscow slams racist EU ban on Russians' private cars. U.S. moves to advance five-prisoner swap deal with Iran, and release $6 billion in frozen Iranian funds. George W. Bush says it was shocking to learn that Yevgeny Prigozhin, known as Vladimir Putin's chef, once served him dinner in St. Petersburg. All I know is I survived. Turkey urges U.S. not to link F-16 sale to Sweden's NATO bid. Pro-China disinformation campaign claims U.S. started Maui fires in a weather weapons experiment, falsely citing the UK's MI6. Neo-Nazi suspects discussed how easy attacking Finland's Prime Minister Santa Marin would be, court hears. In Canada, in 2022, 30% of youth aged 15 to 19 years and nearly half, 48%, of young adults aged 20 to 24 years reported having tried vaping in their lifetime. In comparison, 10% of youth and 27% of young adults had ever tried smoking cigarettes. Adults aged 25 years and older were much less likely to have tried vaping, 15%, and much more likely to have tried cigarette smoking, 52%. IBM software mandates in-office work for employees, living within 50 miles, 80 kilometers. Starfield's official mod tools are coming in 2024. Microsoft to kill off third-party printer drivers in Windows. Microsoft cuts ties with it for first-generation Surface Duo after just three years, and to Android version updates. The Squitter Pino's analysis is found to be the origin of cloud formation. Biodiversity protects against invasions of non-native tree species. Red fire ant colonies found in Italy's Syracuse could spread across Europe, says study. Positive body image linked to better life satisfaction. 
employees under authoritarian leaders are more likely to agree with misinformation, study finds. Mark Dickey, U.S. explorer freed from one of Turkey's deepest caves, Therosaurus indicus, the oldest plant-eating dinosaur found in India's Rajasthan. Nearly one in ten adults in the U.S. has lost a family member to drug overdose, new KFF poll finds, junk food and alcohol dominate Aussie diets, with only two in five getting enough veg, CSIRO finds. Porsche taken an Audi Etron GT recalled for poorly sealed batteries over potential battery fire risk. FDA signs off on updated COVID-19 vaccines to target circulating variants. Threads block searches related to COVID and vaccines as cases rise. FBI and Australian police ran an encrypted chat platform, Anim, to catch criminal gangs, yielding hundreds of arrests and global sting. A European country helped the FBI intercept Anim messages. It had been speculated that Lithuania had hosted the server. Example employee files RICO lawsuit over whistleblower retaliation. Google's rivals get day in court as momentous U.S. antitrust trial begins, as Google faces the DOJ in the first major tech monopoly trial in decades. Teleset Books 14 launches with SpaceX, bypassing Blue Origin and Relativity, for advanced Teleset Lightspeed LEO satellites. Chinese scientists have developed a new gene editing tool that doesn't use CRISPR. Qualcomm says it will supply Apple with 5G modems for iPhones through 2026, as custom 5G modem delayed. The FAA authorizes UPS flight forward and UAVNX to operate drones, beyond visual line of sight. MGM cybersecurity issue shuts down slot machines and ADMs in Las Vegas casinos, and at MGM Resorts properties across U.S., Cisco warns of VPN zero-day exploited by ransomware gangs, as Cisco VPN flaw faces attempted Akira ransomware attacks. BMW to make new electric mini in Oxford, after securing £600 million British pounds package in taxpayer funding, UK manufacturing climbs to 8th in world rankings, overtaking France. In the UK, collapse risk concrete found in Houses of Parliament, but poses no immediate risk. Canada's federal government issues new rules for public servants, using AI. Portuguese hacker who leaked Manchester City documents, Rui Pinto sentenced to four years with a suspended sentence for nine crimes. Two years ago, Manchester City hacker offered Premier League help in FFP, football fair play, investigation.